morning, you guys. Today is November Friday, seventeen, and it is Friday. So November. November seventeenth. I just vanished away myself. Yes, I do take off my shoes and the pants. I just have my shorts underneath. See. I like this tiny little booty shorts on. I don't want to show that. Maybe one day when I lose that, when I get to like 140 pounds. But that's it. That's what I had on when I like um, weigh myself. <sighs> well, before that, before I weighed myself, um, I was in the kitchen. Um, I forgot that I had a, a spaghetti squash. It's, um... But it is, it, it is a squash, and I guess it's in a pumpkin family, and squash, whatever. Um, I cut it in half, um, took out the guts, and sprayed some avocado oil, salt and pepper, and turned it upside down, and baked it in the oven for um, 400 degrees for may, maybe um, an hour or 30 minutes. I'm going to keep checking on it. I think it's different in every oven, so I'm gonna keep checking on it. It's pretty tough. I mean, I had a hard, hard time I'm cutting it in half. So that's what I'm gonna have spaghetti squash. And um, I'm gonna saute some onions, red onions, garlic, um, cabbage, all of that stuff. I'm gonna put it in some, um, this can of um, rotel. I don't know if you guys know that what that is. It's um, canned with tomatoes, onions, garlic, cilantro, um, jalapeno on it. And I'm gonna squish some lemon because I don't have any sauce, so that's like my sauce in the way. I don't really wanna put any sauce. I'm sure I can find some bit of sauce, but I don't wanna put anything that's um, weird in a natural stuff. A hotel, you could, you could read what's everything on it. It's diced tomatoes and all that stuff, so. That's what I'm gonna have on it. So, oh, I did all of that. I'm gonna do this. It's gonna be a while before I be able to eat this nuts. I get, I get the leftover um chopped vegetable from making that um egg soup that I do right here. There's that tiny little induction pot still right there. So like I wanted to have that just like when I'm in my computer, I could like make a little soup or stuff like that. And now I'm gonna try. <laughs> well, maybe when it's not want to cook something, I can do it right here and help you use the big kit, the big appliances in the kitchen. Just use a little thing. So, there it is. <laughs> my coffee maker is right here. Oh, I haven't used that. I just bought that. Cause I think my old one is like breaking down and it was on sale so that one breaks down I have another one prepared I wish they had a white one but they did it so yeah they're red or black I didn't want any black I wanted a red one wish they had white but you know so <coughs> can you ladies that soup yesterday was so good I think it would have been a little too much, but I ate it all. I don't want to want any food. I ate that whole thing. It was a lot. That was like um, half of the cabbage that I used before, but I had to half it because it couldn't fit in that little um, clear pot. It had four eggs. It had two different kind of onions, the red and the green, and all that stuff. But I'm going to use that leftover veggies yesterday that I didn't get to use and put it in my spaghetti, my squash spaghetti. So that's what I'm going to have for breakfast, lunch, and dinner today. I think it's like 7, 7.30-ish. It's gloomy outside. It's been kind of drizzling since yesterday. So this, oh God. I think tomorrow's gonna be in 60-ish. 
So I'm going to enjoy this nice cool weather. <clears throat> I've been busy since I got up. <laughs> I didn't have time to take um drink coffee yet. But I'm gonna get I'm gonna drink some afterwards. I'll make it always done. Because I got a sake and all that vegetable that I'm gonna cook for my food. <clears throat> Anyways, like I said that um when I did a forty three day um oh man it's like i want to incorporate my um my daily life you know what i mean because you gotta eat juicing is not juicing or fasting is not um sustainable you know what i mean that's just something i'm so gonna like juice fast one day when um i want like a quick um weight loss but you know you can never keep it I don't know how other people do it that they keep it, but as soon as that drinking and eating, he came back. So he could even, even if it's healthy food that he eat, he was getting all back. <coughs> but he want something that's very doable. Now, eating once a day is very, very doable. Cause I don't restrict any, um, like calories, I eat whatever uh, I want. I do love fruits and veggies. So it's not hard for me to actually eat this stuff. I'm eating this stuff like this um, for a health reason. I'm eating the stuff that's actually like it and very beneficial. So, and I need to change my way of eating habit. Because as you guys know that I am pre-diabetic um, I already got my gallbladder removed and have a fatty liver. So I've been eating more and more um, veggies than usual. And the doctor, when I got my um, gallbladder removed and my doctor told me I had a fatty liver, the doctor was like, you need to nip it in the butt right now. It's not exercising. It's not eating right. Stay away from too much sugary or very, um, what do you call it? Processed food. So I've been doing that. It's not gonna, the weight is not gonna come up that easily. It's gonna have to become my lifestyle. So this is something that I know I could do. And I do need to lose weight. As you get older, it is harder to lose weight for me, anyways. I know there's a lot of people my age group. It is hard to lose weight. But I mean, if you're happy with the way you look, that's fine. But I'm not, because I know my body is falling apart and I'm getting bigger and bigger. So I need to lose the weight. So I'm doing this for me and for my and doing little exercise. I hate doing exercise. But this little machine, let's give your heart a kick. You do, gives your heart a little, you know, a little something, something. Even just 10 minutes. And after 43 days, I'm gonna try to do the um, 20, and maybe doing 30 and all that stuff. But right now, just getting my body is shoe, doing this stepper. Um, one of you asked, I don't know, what is a stepper called? It's called Sunny, S-U-N-N-Y. Um, Amazon has it. It's like $58.31. There's so many versions of it. There's P, there's something, I think a lot cheaper. I'm not sure. But there are very, very many versions. So whatever it is your price range, go right ahead. Sometimes I look at how many stars, or sometimes I just like, I take a chance, it's like, that's nice and cheap, you know, and it works really good. Has the stool, low, low resistant bands. I'm not gonna do that right now. <laughs> Maybe after 43 days, I'm incorporating for my arms. All right, I'll just 
getting my body used to doing this. <sighs> 10 minutes a day. In 10 minutes, it does. Do something for you. Should do a get out of breath. Trust me, I guess, I guess I'm popping too, so. And very warm. I can feel um, sweat coming out of my nose, my forehead, and top of my upper lip. So, I'm sure if I do this 20 or 30 minutes, I'm sure I will be sweating buckets. But that's in the future. Just 10 minutes for me right now. I'm eating foods that are natural in its form. That helps. I'm not starving my body. I eat till I'm super full. And majority of the time, since I started this, I've been eating a nice big bowls of food. Majority is soup. Maybe sometime this weekend, I want some steak. I want to go eat steak. And you know where I like to eat my steak. I like to go to um, Texas Roadhouse. I like a 20 ounce steak. Majority of the time, I can't finish it. But sometimes there's this crevice in there. So I'm gonna go drink some. This is a spaghetti squash. That's what it says. What I'm gonna do is cut it in half. This is hard to cut. <laughs> this. Ah. Mm. This is what it looks like. I'm gonna like um, take out the seeds, and I'm gonna cut it into a little um, little ring size like like this. I'm gonna put it in the oven for for like 450 degrees for like maybe an hour to see, and you guys will see it afterwards. So I'm gonna take the guts out. It is hard to take it out. I am going to roast this. And I'm going to have spaghetti squash for breakfast, lunch, and dinner. I'm going to put like, um, I'm going to roast. I mean, I'm going to saute some leftover cabbage and onions and garlic. And I'm going to put it in my spaghetti. I'll show you guys later when I'm, when this cooks. Well, this is, it's like seven o'clock now. Um, I'm gonna put this in the oven. And, um, It's really springy. I preheated to 400 degrees. Um, I'm going to put the um, spaghetti squash in there for about maybe 30 minutes or an hour. Probably an hour. I'm not sure. Because every oven is different. So that's what I'm going to do. Here's my spaghetti squash. I took out the guts. Um, I put black pepper and salt underneath, and I'm gonna cook it roasted side down like that. I'm gonna cook it for an hour. <laughs> I don't know if that's too long. I'm gonna keep checking on it to see if that's gonna be enough. It is really hard. I had a hard time opening it and getting our guts out. But that's what I'm gonna have for today. 
one spaghetti squash. I'll show you guys the finishing product later. So, okay, this is what it looks like after an hour. Ooh. Ooh. I literally, I mean, it's been cooling off in here for the last like 10 minutes after like that whole hour. Just let it cool off. That's what it looks like. It's roasted. I'm going to get a fork and show you guys how I'm going to do this. Look, it's still steaming. This is what it looks like. So what I'm going to do is just do this. Look at that. It is perfectly cooked. I throw an hour cooking in um, my oven. It is just like so easy. He does look like spaghetti. Look at that. Do that for this one. It is so easy. Perfect. What I'm going to do is I'm going to saute some vegetables and put it on top. Because I don't have any spaghetti sauce and I don't want to put any spaghetti sauce. I'm trying to eat as healthy as I can possibly. See? I'll show you guys the finishing product. I don't know if I'm going to put veggies and all that stuff. So here's the leftover vegetable yesterday that I couldn't put in my soup. I'm going to like saute it in the pan. And I get some of these rotel. I'm going to put it all together, then put it right here on my spaghetti. My squash spaghetti. Look how easy that might came out. That's a lot. So, it's pretty much as its own bowl. So, I'm just going to scoop this together. Put all the um, vegetable on top. And that's what I'm going to eat. I'm waiting for this to... Cook. It's not gonna take that long. So I want the vegetable being crunchy. It's like all oh, the leftover from yesterday that I couldn't fit in my soup. So, yum! Spaghetti squash. You can hear. Kind of sizzling. Up close, I'm a spaghetti. It's this on clear baking dish. We use this whole baking dish as a plate. Put all this food in it. Yes, I'm going to eat all of those veggies and this one spaghetti squash. I'll show you guys the finishing product. We're all done. Here's what it's doing right now. I'm sauteing cabbage, onions, and I put that different kind of veggies and here's my squash waiting for the food waiting for this one to cook so I'll show you guys when I'm done cooking it and assembling it together I'm gonna try with that you know the vegetable just like a little bit of salt and pepper to taste mmm has a little bit of sweetness to it but I'm waiting for my vegetables to cook, and I'm going to put a top on. Here it is. It's finally done. I'm just going to put it on top of my spaghetti. It's so nice and piping hot. I'm going to eat this whole thing. This whole thing right here. And put it right there. Just over top it. <laughs> it's a mess. I'm not even sure what time it is. It's like 11 o'clock. Exact 11 o'clock now. Just gonna overfill that. I'm gonna put the rest of this in right here. And that's what I'm having for lunch. Sorry for all the mess. I just finished cooking everything. So here it is. 
one whole spaghetti squash. I topped it off with different kind of vegetable, the leftover from yesterday. I'm going to eat that whole thing. Yes, I am. That's my food for the day. My breakfast, lunch, and dinner. And it is 11. Finally done. <sighs> so, I'm going to go sit down and download this video and eat my food at the same time. So, hope you guys enjoy it. <laughs>